Hello guys, I have another video for you. Had you ever thought like that this the new iPod Touch is so expensive you can't afford it? Well, me too. So I decided to do something nice. I'm going to give you a review on my iPod Touch. I do want Siri, so but you could get some apps, but it may be a while. So let's go. Basically, my iPod Touch is like an iPhone 4 and a 4S created together. Now we're going to discover the 4 part. Now let's go discover why it's like 4. The iPhone 4 has voice control and a tiny screen. And that's really all it. The iPhone, this iPod has voice control on it. But as you see, the 4S part is about setting it up manually from the iPod instead of, you know, connecting to your computer and, um, setting up stuff. But the bad news is you do not get Siri. So now we're going to go into the gaming experience. The gaming experience is not that bad if you don't... It does feel like it's a lot more wider I felt like but the gamings are really good it's still popular today and basically it's not that bad now YouTube if you're using the regular YouTube on Safari that would be okay but you should just tilt it like this way and to see it but if you're using like that app YouTube, it's kind of in a line about how it shows those little black things in the way when you want to tilt it to see a wider screen. Which a lot of people should do. Basically, I did discover some things. You could find your white iPod better than your black version, but this is not why I'm talking about this. And the camera is super weak on this one than the newer one. So, now I'm going to discover about the prices. Now, as we all know, when it was in popular and before all that new fancy 5th gen came out, it was expensive, like the 5th gen. Well, now it's 199 starting at the 6 gigabytes and 100 and $236 for the 32 gigabytes, which actually makes no sense. I think the one, the 16 gigabyte is higher, and they put it in for cheaper. Apple is just goofing up. But the funny thing is about this app store is about all this stuff that's free is making me mad. Because they're mostly like the demos. That's basically it. It still works like a great device. You can still do stuff. But if you prefer Siri, I would recommend buying the iPhone 4S or the iPod Touch 5th Gen. And but if you don't want Siri, because you, if you don't want to use Siri that much, I know I would use Siri like all the time. And if you don't want to use Siri that much, then I suggest buying the Fortune until at least it gets outdated and stops working. Okay. And it's not working that good anymore. That's basically it, guys. Click the like this button below. Thanks for watching and subscribe to my channel. By the way, the old video that says my hide thing main four my hide main four that is meant to say home again thanks for watching click the thumb click the like button if you liked it and subscribe and please leave some comments because I could help you get back with your eye if you need like any help on any generations of iPods I could actually leave a comment there and to help you I want so much about Apple products you do not want to know Sunny outside.